What up, YouTube? It's your boy Atrocity. We back at it again. All right, so today I'm going to show y'all how to put a beat on the grid in Mixcraft, but this will work in any DAW. You just have to know how to do what I'm doing, all right? So the first thing is you always want to find, you know, your key, your tempo of your beat. Like I made this beat, so of course I labeled it. Um, so it's 125 um, in this D minor. So I come down here and I put it this tempo on 125. Now, if you are somebody that doesn't make beats or you didn't make your own or don't have the tempo, one thing you can do is buy mixed in key, like I have mixed in key, as well as you have alternatives. If we go here to my browser, you can do Mixmeister, go to the BPM analyzer, and it's only $1.99. So, um, or you can take the free route and you can do TuneBet, which has a song and key BPM finder. So let's just see how well it works. I'm going to drag my beat in here and see if it gives me the same thing. All right, so let's drag that right there. All right, shouldn't take too long. Okay, so D minor and 125. So it works, guys. All right, now let's go back to Mixcraft. Now, what you want to do to put the beat on the grid, since we, we set the tempo and we know what the tempo is, what I'll do is come all the way to the front of the beat and you want to zoom in. Well, zoom out for the most part. Yeah, right here. So you see this dead space. So what we're going to do is select all this dead space. So you see, we want to come right before the beat drops. And then we're going to delete that dead space and we're going to move this here. And I'm going to loop a section. So I want to take from nine to one and then i'm going to turn on my loop right here i'm gonna hit play and hit m and then we'll see if it loops perfectly all right so far so good all right perfect loop all right and then we can come here to like a drum section. So let's do like nine to 13. All right, perfect. So now, now when you have the tempo set like that, that allows you to be creative and do other things. Like I'm gonna duplicate this track, Let me get rid of this part, and then I'll drag one up here. So then I can come up here and I like one knob filter. So we go stereo one knob filter. All right, so like I drag this down. Now because it's on the grid, I can take a section of this beat. So we'll go split this, and then we'll split this B. It will drag this up here. So now we go from. All right, so you can do things like that. Um, let's see, you can change your grid up here. Like I have mine set the bar, but you can change it to like the beats up here. So then I got to learn the shortcuts in here. So then let's just say if we wanted to uh, cut this part, we'll delete that and then we'll take B, we'll hold Alt and then drag this here. So now you got it. got stuff like that then you can just start going in here and you can cut stuff out of the beat you know this is a little simple stuff all right so it's also useful in case you need to fly like a a piece of the hook or something so like uh let me turn the effects on and then i'll turn on my auto tune yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, so like say we just recorded something really quick. 
Yeah, whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. Yeah, you know what I'm having. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. All right, so, All right, so boom. boom, boom. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna put this back on bar, and then I'm gonna select this. And I'm gonna crop it. So now if I hold up, we drag this. Okay. Oh, oh, we're we'll gonna drag this here. And now let's look. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. Yeah, you know what I'm having. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. All right, so that's one thing. And then let's change the grid up. Put it on the fourth. All right. And then I come here. Let's just say if I wanted this part right here. Put B. Hit B right there. All right. And then I hold Alt. Drag this down and put this here. Let's see. So how you got it. Money, a whole lot of racks. Whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. Having. Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. Whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having. So like now I can create a different version of the hook or let's say you know what I'm having, whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. You know what I'm having, whole lot of money, a whole lot of money. Alright, so like how it's a whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks, you know what I'm having. Now you could take Let's see. You know what I'm having, whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. I took this and split this, and then I can move these around. Put this here. Let's see. Yeah, you know what I'm having? Whole lot of money, a whole lot of racks. Whole lot of money, a whole lot. Yeah, but this doesn't work in this case. But this gives you the range to do that. Um, something else you could do is like how I seen like future and return to server. Like, I've seen Future and, like, some of his artists recording in the studio, they'll say the same word a bunch of times, and then they'll take the best word, all right? So, like, I'm going to show y'all real quick. Like, um, hold up. Let's see. Let's see. see, see, see. <laughs> all right. So, all right, like, watch so this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Whole lot of racks, 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 whole lot of racks. All right, so let's just say I think this is the best one. Right? Right. So now I can prop. And I just hit C to do that. Um I set up my shortcuts to crop with C. So now this is the best one. So I can bring this right here. All right. And it's because it's on the grid. Then if I want to keep copying over. Whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks. Whole lot of racks. Like if I wanted to do that. Um, if there was another one that I liked, let's see which other one was. Whole lot of racks, 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 whole lot of racks. Yeah, or if I like this one, like this one, like this one, like this one, I can just split the clip here, boom, split here, and then just kind of. Drag it here, and then I can mute what's up here, and then I could just be duplicating this one. There you go. Whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks, whole lot of racks. All right, or if you did something for ad libs, right? So you can just. If you want this to be a hope, if you just want this to be the ad lib, so like I drag this down here. Uh, let's see. 
So if I record it. So we'll put this here, here, and then we'll drag this here. here. All right, all right. So now you so just now created ad libs from another track, another right? Track. So. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm having? I'm turning it up. I'm running it up. I can't act out the mud. I'm running it up. Yeah. Let's see. So, so. Let's see. Let's see. I'm running it up. I came out of mud. So I'm running it up, all out of racks. You know what I'm having, all out of racks. All right, so let's just say this was my hook. So I'm gonna drag this down, right there, right there, right there. So, so boom, boom. We're gonna assume this is the hook. So now I can take. All of this, and then drag it over, 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 right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. So, 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 so. So now I got a hook that fast, right? I'm running it up. All out of racks. I came out of mud. All out of racks. So I'm running it up. All out of racks. You know what I'm having? All out of racks. I'm running it up. Came out of mud, all out of racks. So I'm running it up, all out of racks. You know what I'm having, all out of racks. All right, and then let's just say for the yeah, ear, we wanted to put the, put the beat back in the filter. Back in the filter. So now I'm running it up, all out of racks. I came out of mud, all out of racks. So I'm running it up, all out of racks. You know what I'm having, all out of racks. I'm running it up, all out of racks. I came out of mud, all out of racks. So I'm running it up, all out of racks. You know what I'm having. All right, so, All right, now, so, now, so now you got to be on the grid. You made your hook. All right, you need to put the hook in the next place. Let's just assume it goes to 28. So now, what I want to do is just hit B right here. So we're taking. Oh, I'm going to take all of these. I'm gonna zoom out, zoom out, and then hold up, and I'm gonna drag it to 28. 28, 28, 28, 28, 28. So, 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 so. Now, now, now. Running it up, all out of racks. I came out of mud, all out of racks. So I'm running it up, all out of racks. You know what I'm having, all out of racks. I'm running it up, all out of racks. I came out of mud, all out of racks. So I'm running it up. You know what I'm having. So yeah. So yeah. Um, 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 um that's it. When you put the beat on the grid, let me turn this stuff off. But yeah, when you put the beat on the grid, you can do anything. All right. So that was just a simple tutorial. But like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. I'm out.